It's really nice to be back on campus at ESMT as a guest lecturer today, seven years after completing the Bringing Technology to Market program. When I joined BTM back in 2016, I was with Daimler working on creating a new business and bringing that to the market. Then I was with a startup, also trying to bring technology to the market. And then I moved from horizontal mobility to vertical mobility. Today, I'm working with Kona, the elevator and escalator company as the chief innovation officer. If you live in an apartment building, work in an office, taking metro or public transportation in a city, you probably belong to one of the one billion people we move every day. And this is what motivates me to get up to work every day to find out how we can make that journey better. I think whether you're talking about innovation or bringing technology to market, we're talking about entering new territories. So that often means that there will be a change and there will be a change, likely also a change of business model. So this is very much the part I learned from that program and to apply that on my everyday job. I still remember back in the days, our professor Olaf was talking about how challenging it will be from a strategic perspective to move a company from a product company to a service company and to the more complex combination of service and product to a solution. And this is also very much what I face every day. So how can I bring a new solution out of an established product company? Well, I think the more memorable part of the experience probably was more the one outside the class, so how much fun we had with the classmates back then. But I also remember maybe one other was related to the management science part of decision making, um, how much it's more probability driven and how you can fold an issue tree and make decisions based on that. Quite often in actual practice, we tend to rely um, judgments, particularly from senior management or consensus to make decisions. And this scientific part of decision making is very often undervalued. I've tried to bring that part at least partially to how I and my team will make decisions. And we also try to run innovations more as a portfolio, so very much utilizing the power of probability in that. So that's also something I think I very much get out of the BTM program.